Hi Nipa Tiri viewers. Today is going to see some interesting topics. Already uh, we discussed about how to upload the file into the web server or into the database or into the folder. Let me see uh, how to check file is existed in this file upload control. Normally, uh, we can check through using some validation control called record field validator or something. Here, I am we can able to check through client side also that I will show you now. I am just added this on click event. I think this is already I did in the previous video. If you want to see in step by step you just go through our previous videos this is uh, the method i used for save actually the previous method it sends files from server into the server sorry Now I am going to add one label control here to display the message. For example, uh, how you can know whether the file is there or not. So I am going to add one displaying message. I can use this one control called ASPX semicolon label to display this control. Okay, now we are going to see how to do this things in clear way there is a label you can see this ok now I am going to check the condition if file upload that means that idea of that file upload control file upload has file yeah this is the id I am showing you again file upload dot has file if that file upload has a file then you do this process else you just written the file there is no file in the file upload browser so please re-enter something like that I'm going to enter and I'm going to see how it works these things are very easy i think if you have any doubt you just comment it in our videos tutorial page i will explain you in detail in depth if you can't or if you want if you're not able to catch these points what i am saying okay no issue i am this is a label id dot text equal to i am going to pause this label label text as no file is chosen no file is found this is good right yeah okay I'm just saving this file and I'm going to run this application choose the file something called this is uh, some sample logos I am having I am just submitting these things it saved successfully just refreshing this root directory by there is a simple call refresh this I am using is visual studio 2012 this advanced technology here we are going to learn MVC also so I installed these things now I am just reloading this application okay actually in view state uh, that saved successfully is stored so it's not possible here to reload so uh, I am just running if you have any doubt about view stored you just go through our videos submit yes now it's storing this error no files found that means if it's there is no file in this file upload it, it will throw this message yes it's working fine now
likewise we are adding or we are checking in the server side whether the file is exist in this file upload control or not thanks for watching guys uh, uh, next video i going to see uh, i will show you how to uh, restrict uh, only the uh, files for example i am adding the jpeg files uh, it will restrict the pdf files